Robinson off the Matumbo screen. Williams there. Anderson forces Iverson right. Coleman, that's a two. Sometimes he doesn't seem like he enjoys the game as Iverson nails the three, but he's enjoying it this year. The foul troubles early helped as Iverson knocks it down. Allen Iverson hit his first two shots from the field, then missed eight in a row, and ends that streak with that bucket. Well, I just think that he has such great versatility. I would just like to see him do both. Post, drive, and then shoot. And this fires. Paul Pierce with only two field goal attempts. Sometimes you get that early foul trouble. As Iverson hits the off-balance shot. You go to the bench with early foul. And great body control and ability to absorb the contact. There it is. Then it's a fadeaway, off-balance, yet the concentration to finish the shot. And as he goes in there, I mean, that's just such a difficult shot. I mean, a guy taking a body contact, body blow, drifting back and to his right, finishes it off. A whole lot of semblance of order right now, and sometimes you get caught up in those stretches in the game. Spurs leading the series two games. Once he gets up in the air, and the tumble comes across. That's a tough object to shoot over. Iverson gets the roll. About before, not a lot of free throw attempts. That's only his fifth. Can't stand up about Eric Snow. Eric Snow is everything that's right in the NBA. The way he approaches, the way he plays at both fronts for him, open things up for him and his teammates. Going to hurt their defensive rebounding. Coleman got a piece of it and kept it alive. Iverson to the glass and gets the roll. Tie game. And Pierce turns it over. McKee knocked it away. Iverson inside. Philly by two. Timeout, Boston. Not to just inches on who grabs a loose ball like that. Iverson falling away. Puts it in. He waited to see him stop, pull up, and look to get the defender in the air. Right now is when he wants Anderson to go up. Paul Pierce calling for the ball there. Iverson gets the first. How ironic would it be? Philly struggling from the line all game long. Big missed free throws, but perhaps conceal the victory at the line right now. Three-point game, 1.6 remaining. Regardless of how this game turns out right now, from a Boston standpoint, they came in and played a heck of a game. I really thought this was going to be a big win for Philadelphia tonight coming in here. I thought Boston would be saying, look, we're going to be going back home to play game number five. They never backed off an inch here tonight. The answer, they call him, he's got the last seven points for Philadelphia. And he hits this one, and they are headed back to Boston. The Celtics will call timeout, but with 1.6 seconds remaining, Allen Iverson has given the Sixers a four-point lead.